So here's the Axis Bank, the first of all topics for the next week, and that's a banking stock company we all know. E ratio is also uh, well, not too too much of a value, then it's good In profits. You can see that's 14.41 is the P ratio industry standard of it's okay and profits are increasing and it is good all the four or five years if you see no so fundamentally it's a strong stock and uh, FI is a, a big chunk of that around 50 percent or something and it's constantly making profit that's the basic thing right and let's see the charts and you, you can see a panel channel is running from multiple years probably since 2022 onwards and now it is rising up and it is in the 60 uh, above which is the bullish zone and trend indicator radius is also bullish zone. So, number risk reward is 1 is to 3 or 4 can easily be attached towards the time channel top. You can see that it has been steadily uh, moving within this trend line channel. The surrounding pattern and consolidation breakout can be seen. So, it's a very easy target that can come in if the breakout really sustains and it has been steadily, steadily going with decent correction in trends within the panel channel. So, have time stop us and give it a try if this breakout is going to happen. Otherwise, wait for another chance. Volumes are also reasonably good along with the RSI and the trend indicator. So, that's about So, that's a So, there's the next one that's the Titan come Titan. It's a jewelry watch company and all that. It's a Tata company uh, along with a joint development industrial terminal or something. So, it's a it's fundamentally strong, uh, very strong. So, Petrovsky score is also good but not that great right uh, but uh, if you see the net profit has been rising consistently up giving around 20 percent for the last five years and shareholding pattern shows that a good FI holding is around you know, in net 20 percent of holding is by the FIS and the is all weekly hold but on technical charts if you see you can also here also you can see a multi-year well, just in 21 onwards you can see a battle channel is running there and it has been correcting uh, since work time and so recovery phase that's happening and in, in the phase that we are going to capture is the upside towards the panel challenge will give it reasonable risk reward of at least you know, more than minus three range can easily be achieved the volumes are good momentum is good and trend is good that's a very simple mistake so this is the trend line channel is very strong and strong has not been rocketing this like other stocks that has happened since the last one or two years it is actually steadily making the currency and moving on ADX and other side indicators are also positive in the bull zones and the summer risk reward trade can be achieved here right third one that's a marico marico is a fmcg company we know that it's a group um, mariwala that's a group and it's um, having a lot of products like parachutes and you know, so that's the fmcg sector also is holding the market right now the ratio is a little high or, or value we can see but um, uh, uh, fundamentally if you see the profits uh, but also coin is also good yeah Moving on to see the profits, and that's also steadily rising up. But uh, now nah, you can expect 60 six percent only. But that's how FNCG has been performing, right? So, um, FI is having a very strong good holding of 25 percent nearby, and DIA is also hold 10 12 percent. So, then that's what uh, the stock's fundamental is. So, moving on to the chart, you can see that the, here also you have this parallel channel, and the move expected is towards the top of the channel. There is a rounding pattern and the consolidation of multiple years, two or three years was happening there. And then it broke out and now it is a phase where it is really going towards the top of the channel, the trend line channel that's 64 multiple years. So that should be reasonably, you know, have a good risk of what. The, the volumes are also good enough, not ex extra good, but moment is about the other side, 60. The trend is also slightly big. The strength is slightly big, but it is in the bullish zones. So, trying to get radius, RSI, volumes, price pattern, and reasonable risk of what possibilities there. I have to stop process to mention here. That's all.